Nick, during a wrestling tournament at a local high school. Some pretty scary moments when an off-duty police officer accidentally discharged his gun during that meet. Fortunately, nobody was seriously hurt. This happened at Fowlerville High School. The gym emptied. The tournament was halted for half an hour. Coco McAvoy reports from Fowlerville High School. It started off as a regular wrestling meet here at Fowlerville High School, but it quickly took a turn after a bizarre incident. Get in there. This video was taken during the meet before the chaos. Several kids, like 12 year old John Allen, came to compete. I just wanted to wrestle, though. That's what we do, right? Yeah. John was preparing to wrestle when the unexpected happened. I'm waiting by my mat on a stair, and right next to me, about like five inches away, all I hear is a loud boom and a gun goes right next to my foot and barely misses me. John was in the thick of it. I just remember right away I just yelled and my mom grabbed me and I just ran. Coaches like Maxwell Johnson immediately checked on their kids too. For most kids they've never heard a gunshot so it scares them and it's really emotional. So what happened? A parent had a, uh, a revolver in their pocket that uh, discharged somehow and, uh, and went off during the middle of our wrestling tournament. That parent happens to be an off-duty officer who was at the school to watch his son wrestle. Police say the gun accidentally discharged somehow and the bullet ended up in the gymnasium floor. After the police were here and did their investigation and did what they had to do, uh, we were able to resume wrestling and actually finish our tournament. After a scary incident at the wrestling meet that could have been much worse. This time it was an accident. Yeah, of course. Never know. And we are told that one person did twist their ankle while running away. But other than that person, no one was injured. And that's, of course, the best news in all of this tonight. Back to you. And Coco, any idea tonight? Will that officer be facing any sort of charges? So police say this is still under investigation. However, they do say the case is being turned over to the prosecutor's office. So that officer could face charges. All right. We'll be following it. Thank you, Coco.